All right, now we're going to do a short field takeoff. And I'm here on the runway, so I don't want to waste a lot of time. What I'm going to do is I'm going to power up the engine. I'm holding my brakes. I check all my instruments, make sure everything is good to go. And everything looks good. I'm going to release the brakes. You're going to feel a lot of left turning tendency. So right rudder, right? Now here, we want to rotate and climb out of VX. So we're rolling, we're rolling. I got one notch of flaps, we're rolling. She's ready to fly. And I'm gonna climb out at about 60, okay? 60 miles per hour, there we go. We wanna clear the 50 foot obstacle. We're emulating that there's a tree out there or some sort of mountain or hill or something that we're clearing. Okay, maybe it's even 100 feet tall. We can keep going here. Okay, you don't wanna get any slower than this. I see my nose about one inch above the horizon. Once we've cleared the obstacle, I just push forward a little bit on the yoke, okay? I start accelerating. I can clean up the airplane. And accelerate the VY. We did VX, we did VY, and now we're going just like we did on the normal takeoff, climbing out at 80 miles per hour in this airplane. It will be different for your airplane, VY best rate of climb, okay? So climbing out now on the departure leg, and I'll show you uh, part of the pattern here in the next video for the short field landing, all right? So let's hold, head over there, subscribe, like, share, and I will see you guys there. Until next time, throttle on. Fly on over to aviatortraining.com for online ground school, podcasts, videos, and more to become or grow as an aviator.